Hey guys, it's John with ClearPlan. I'm going to show you an interesting feature here today. And this feature is one that a lot of drivers don't know about. And so we're going to take this video to kind of show you guys how to use this feature and why it's important for you. So I'm logged into ClearPlan and I'm filtering the area by these three zones in Las Vegas. So these three zones is by one of one of the uh, drivers in Las Vegas. And what we're going to show you today is a really important piece of clear plan especially for agents out in the field so if I look at this map right now I see all these icon points on the map how do I know where I've visited right so I come in in the morning or I come in at night whenever your shift starts and you want to try to figure out where you stopped the day before and where you need to begin today so we've built this really cool feature in clear plan that allows you to do that so if we look at this zone right here this is three different zones I'm gonna go ahead and just display the zones real fast so you can see so there's our zones, right? This driver in this area should be able to run each zone every day. And that's how we've built these zones within, within this area in Las Vegas. Each zone, driver should be able to go through one day and hit every, every point on the map. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn the zones off and we'll go back to filters. As you can see, I have three zones selected. And what I'm gonna show you right here, we're gonna center the map right now, right now and we wanna see where that driver has left the day before. What jobs has he hit? So we go up here, right here on this gear icon. If you move your mouse over there and hover it, you get these three options. Show check-ins prior to, show days since last check-in, and show number of check-ins. What I'm gonna use right now is this slider, show check-ins prior to. So when I click my mouse and drag from left to right, I want you to watch the icons on the map. See how those icons start to fade? So as I scroll, now I can know that down here in this left-hand corner is the area that Kaylin ran yesterday. Let's come back up here. So this is show check-ins prior to one day. I'm going to keep moving this. Let's keep going. Look at the icons fading away. Now we go to two days. So now we know, just by looking at this, that Kaylin has ran this zone in the left hand corner and this zone over here on the right so today when he comes into work where does he start right it's easy he knows exactly where to start because he can look at the fadeaways he's probably gonna start in this left hand corner and start moving left to right on his map so this check-in feature is really valuable for you guys it keeps you on track and this is one of the main features why we don't need a run list with clear plan you can come in every day do this you'll know exactly where to go so I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off. Now I wanna show you one more feature. So sh show days since last check-in. This is pretty cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on yes on this. And now what you need to do is you need to scroll way into your map. Okay, so I'm scrolling in. And now you can see these little green numbers right here, right here, right here, right here. So what this is telling you is these are all the days since last check-in. So it's been one day since we checked into here, one day here, it's been two days here, up here it's five days. So this is a really important feature for you guys to look at and you'll give you a quick snapshot of where you've been, how many days since last check-in. And the reason why you gotta scroll in pretty far on your map like this is just because we're rendering so much data. So that's one thing you gotta be aware of when you do come in on here and click this or even show number of check-ins you just got to make sure to scroll way into your map all right so last thing I want to show you too we made a couple of updates this week we've changed the filter options so now you have all of your filter types all in one place right we have priority and checked in only once and then we have your custom icons are all in one place now in addition we've moved your advanced alerts into filter by address so now you can see we have homework alternate camera scan and we have your advanced alerts down here day and night scans so that's it for this video guys I hope you use this feature uh, we know for sure the guys using this feature are really seeing a huge lift so thanks and have a great one